I'm trying to do this thumbnail. Um. Okay. Hey, what's going on, Dippy Dudes? It's a sad, sad video today. As we're here to talk about Joy Logano cheating to get the champion. I mean. I mean, winning the championship. Uh, I'm just going over a little. I was trying to get a thumbnail, like, because I want to talk about it. So I'm going to give, like, an overview of my perspective and what happened. Because it is, it's a lot to cover with this race. And I don't know how to explain it. Okay, so to start off, we started the race. Denny Hamlin with pole um, gave Kyle Busch the the advantage of the first pit box and stall, which didn't really help. First couple of cautions, but the last caution it extremely helped. Um, and then Kevin Harvick. Nothing really happens. Kevin Harvick um, wins stage one. And then we have stage two, and I believe, I can't remember precisely, but nothing really happened. It's just that Kyle Larson had a lot, a lot of speed on the corners and then on the straightaways because he would have runs off of corners and just, so... In a way, it wasn't a terrible thing because Logano wasn't, he was irrelevant. Um, it was like, I don't know how to say it. Um, Harvick and Larson were the big two in the first two stages until coming to the end. But enough said, Larson takes away takes away um stage two and then we get a little bit into the pit everybody's happy with their vehicles whatever and a couple laps in stage three the final stage Larson Larson nicks the apron and ruins his whole chance of getting a win and win that season it, it was uh it was on yeah it was one of the worst sights and worst things that i could have imagined um to happen cuz larson he hasn't won yet this season or he ha he didn't win this season and, um, it really sucks. He had a great car all weekend, all day, running on the high side, getting all the speed that they can, making them all the ground that they can. And it's really a shame that you hit the apron, your car spins, and you can't do nothing about it. It really sucks, because I like Larson, um, not as much as... These two, but you know what? Stop it! Oh my god! But not as much as those two that I just showed you. So, after that, everything goes fine and dandy. Truex fights Logano for, and Harvick for the championship lead. And pits, whatever. Mandatory pit stops. Kyle Busch stays out. Pretty much everybody else goes in. Kyle Busch leads till about 25 laps. They don't go. Caution comes out. What they've been wanting happens. The caution comes out. And yes. The amount of excitement that I'm guessing Kyle and all of his teammates were felt was, yes, we have a chance at the championship. Now... They pit along with all the other Final Four drivers and pretty much everybody on the lead lap. 
goes to the pits, fun and dandy, right? And now on the restart, Truex is, he likes, he's a, um, what one of the, the broadcasters said, he's a bottom feeder. So he would go to the bottom of the track, and he'd get a lot of positions there. Kyle should have went to the bottom, or the inside for the restart. He did not. He let he went to the outside for the restart. He let Truex in on the inside. One of the worst mistakes I think that happened, because Truex can't he couldn't keep the speed. It takes about 15 laps for his car to kick it up into gear and go. Logano, on the other hand. Uh, took the lead away from Truex in about five laps after that. Oh, I didn't even tell you how the caution came out. Uh, Brad got loose, hit Daniel Suarez, or Brad made contact with another driver. Driver made contact with Brad, and then domino effect, Daniel Suarez went around. Anyways, back to what I was talking about before. <sighs> um, That... God, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah. Logano gets the lead with about nine laps to go or ten. Pulls away. Truex lost a bunch of speed and momentum at that time. He tried his hardest to get back up. Unless Logano. And it was clean racing because nobody was near Logano except for lap traffic for the rest of the race. About three laps to go. I knew that. There was no chance. Oh, but he might blow a motor. He might spin himself. There was no chance of that. He ran good all weekend. And it's a shame that um, he'll get in trouble for cheating in the next 24 hours. So, you know, you know. I can. Anyways, so he leads. And he, for now... Is the 2018 monster <laughs> the 2018 Monster Cup champion? No, this shouldn't be happening. He shouldn't have even been in the final four because of what happened at Martinsville. Um, ow! He shouldn't be in the top four. He shouldn't have. And he was. Um, I'm surprised nobody else like found something wrong with what he did. Like, okay, nobody like broadcast wise. Cause yes, people had mixed opinions on it and blah 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 blah. But nobody really had like a big opinion on it media wise. They weren't like, look down of sucks or anything like that. I mean, I bet some places, but if everybody, media and everybody, was so mad when uh, Kyle Bush did it to, what's his name, Larson at, did the bump and run at Larson at Chicago Land and spun him. But that had everybody's media attention. But... When Logano does it to Truex, media's like, oh, no, 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 no. We're backing him up. We're backing him up. No. Logano just did a bump and run. It's fine. Okay, whatever. Um, I didn't agree with it. But you know what? Not really my thing to say. But he, Logano, for now is the 2018 champion. Um, I feel bad for Truex because last year's Furniture Row Racing, such a great car, and it was passed. If Kyle Busch on the restart would have chose the bottom lane, he had enough momentum and speed to win it. But he didn't and let Truex get the best of it and use that to an advantage and passed. 
which is really frustrating because if I were a driver when like I play, I'm gonna choose the inside. Why would you choose the outside? Texas, Kevin Harvick, he knew he could win on the outside because he had a cheat in or a cheat. He was bending the rules a little bit. But I find something suspicious that suspicious that doesn't add up. So Logano is he's working his hardest. He's struggling. Like not struggling like help, but he has a little bit of an issue. And can't really keep up with Kyle Bush. Kosh comes out because of Brad and Daniel Suarez. And goes to the pits. He usually is the first one out of the pits. This time it wasn't. He, and then he passed, he was running his own race for the rest of the race. Passed anybody and everybody. So, something may have happened in the pits that wasn't just a uh, little tweak. But you know what? I'm not going to go too in depth. In depth, in depth. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And Logano, can't wait to see um, posts on Instagram and Twitter about how you cheated to win. So, Truex, if you didn't cheat, you're lucky because you are the 2018 champion. Guys, I hope you learned something from this video, and that is that Logano's an idiot. And so is Brad. Brad's a moron, but Logano's an idiot. See ya. Oh, also, like, subscribe, and share to all your friends. Bye.